All right. Uh, let's see, once I get this answer, I should be good to go. We got 12 people in the voice chat. There is 14 in the raid. Uh, make sure that your name on Discord represents the same as the one you have in game. Are you Mike Hanshaw? Alright, I'll uh, I'll edit for you. Makes it easier. Uh, we are missing. We're missing Bruce Nicker, and we are missing. Let's see here. Balding. I have Balding right because he's in. Uh... The molten core. Oh. All right, well, Bald Nick is going to be our main tank today. Uh, let's have all right, so pretty much, uh, let's have crit. You're going to be the major off tank today, right? And uh, on the the boss with the three of them, we're going to have Rusnika tanking the third one. Other than that, Rusnika, you're basically just going to be DPS today. All right. We should be good to go. Sure. All right. Uh, Rusnika, you were Stink Fist, right? Yeah. All right. I'll just forcefully rename yourself on Discord. There we go. It seems Thank like you. we got everyone. Make sure you get your SRs in. Uh, SRs are found in, found in the CG Wednesday channel. Now that everyone is in the Discord, I could just also send it. Hmm. Do you want me to off tank the trash or? Uh, just like if something starts running loose, uh, pick sure. it up. Yeah. Yeah. Well, Nick should be good. He has pretty good gear. All right. Without further ado, we can start pulling. On your command, Balnik. My crit's going in. He loves it. And how we're going to be doing loot is uh, for anything that is not bind on pickup from trash, we're going to be neat rolling, if you want it, of course. Uh, but obviously, when it comes to bind on pickup, you are uh, need rolling if you are main specking, or off spec you're greeting, if neither you're passing. Because we have some new people with us today, we are also going to be going over every boss before we pull them. You're putting the pace here, uh, tanks. You pull when ready, but make sure that the healers have mana. Uh, our healers today is uh, Shiro, and we also have a fire, and there's going to be a rest of shaman coming, but right now that's just it. Two, make sure they have mana before you pull anything. Especially on these packs. 
Yep. All right. And because we have two mages with us today, we can do the slave packs pretty easily. Let's see here. Okay, you can invite George Uh, all right. Let's see. Yeah. How do you spell that again? Uh, you spell it in Rachel. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Uh, on this next pack here, we're gonna be doing a sheep pull. Uh, so Aseni, you're gonna be on Moon, and uh, Soliana, you're going to be on Square. Used. Polymorph them, and that's going to start to pull. You're the judge. Go for it. Let's make sure we don't hit the, the, the slaves, but we are killing the school, school first. We need to kill that as fast as possible. Good stuff. And Hunter, make sure you always uh, place down Frost Trap in case anything gets loose. All right, one tank dead. Okay, let's start moon. Make sure you prioritize the curse of the tanks. All right, let's pull back. Let's make sure we get the rest of out on the people that died. Make sure that the shaman has Discord links well. All right, seems like we're good on the rebuffs. We can pull, uh, but let's wait for the path here. There's a few good options, Arlady. There's the Tiger Hide Cloak, a Gelatine Hit. There's the two Rings of Gin, both pretty nice. Um, Fang of the Faceless, good. And the Main Hand Warblade, both really good weapons for hunters. to make sure that Jadrika also has the SR sheet. Yeah, it's a good choice. Both those rings are really good. It's nice to have both of them too. As we're about to pull this next boss, we're going to be looking to SR sheet as well. Uh, let's pull this back over here. On the left side, I marked with the scope. Oh, well, I think it's AFK, crit, pick it up, pick the school up. And yep, you have two soft reserves. So you can reserve the same thing twice to get two. Well, if you're the only person soft reserve, one thing you could get anyway, but yeah. Pick a second item if you want. Once again, we're going to be doing a poly pull. Uh, let's have uh, the hunter shoot triangle. It's going to pull all the ads, but not the boss. And then uh, once the hunter has pulled, make sure that the polymorphs go out. Hunter, you can pull. Get ready with the polymorphs. Same marks. Good stuff. Hello. Hello, hello. Can you please 
please tell me the sheet. Where can I find it? Because I'm looking for it. Uh, let's see. Uh, the sheet is found in the CG Wednesday channel. Uh, I will put it in raid warning as well. Okay. Everyone is in the Discord at this point. I'm uh, gonna assume Boyo is Jurnica. Uh, Jurjit, yes, thank you. All right, cool, cool. All right. Google, you're all almost here as well. Uh, for this boss, uh, it has uh, quite a lot of mechanics, so make sure to listen up. First of all, melee, your highest priority is killing the totems that the boss puts down. There's going to be healing and there's going to be a mind control totem. For obvious reasons, both need to die. Uh, we're going to have a seni on the skeleton pit. So you, when you see skeletons appear, you just kill them with blizzard or whatever. Uh, and then also the boss is going to be applying a hex on the main tank. So we need to make sure that both our tanks have aggro. Pretty sure the, taunt is, uh, the boss is tauntable, so it shouldn't be a problem, but you just make sure be ready for it. And the most important part of this fight is that random people are going to be cursed, and while they are cursed, they are able to see Shades. And Shades is going to be attacking a bunch of people at random, but only people that are cursed are able to see them. So if you are cursed, your biggest priority is killing the Shades. Other than that, that is the boss fight, we just nuke him down. Uh, let's bring it over to Master Loot. Uh, have you gotten your SR in, Jurjika? Bear in mind, um, I'm not sure if mentioned really, but the first idols have as a for guildies yet. Yeah, that's uh, in the announcement I put in World Chat and all that. Fair enough, yeah, we're good. All right, uh, let's pull the boss. Step right up. Make sure the Withered Mistress dies first. Warlocks tap away, you got any. As any, make sure the Skeleton Pit is always dead. Baldix is cursed. Bring the Shogun. Gone. Alright, then bring some job. The Totems, make sure to kill the Totems. Totems now. Melee. That's your one job. Good. Shadow curse. Person is cursed. Totem. 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 You always have to be killed instantly, guys. Totem. Yeah, guys, it's a lot of shit. Always part of the shades when you can. All right. Jersey guys got an end the SR. I'm going to lock the sheet. Uh, Jersey guy, you have two SRs, but I'm going to assume you put the same SR on the same item. Mm, probably, but it's okay. Yeah. Otherwise, just uh, whisper me if you have not gotten uh, two SRs in on the SR sheet. Uh, let's see here. So, let's start it off with the idol. And this is going to be guildies only. Uh, so, only guildies who have SR'd it, uh, as in murder mittens members. Roll now. If you have two SRs on it, you get to roll twice. Okay, ascending 92 twice. Interesting. Wow. And seems like no one's speeding it. So, uh, congrats, Ascending. Yeah, congrats. Does anyone need. Let's see, there should be nothing on these. Uh, nope. don't, don't pull for a second, by the way, because I'm super. Um yep. Didn't Always make sure to... the healers are full of mana. Anyone needs that for any reason, take it. I know this next pull can. Get quite hairy if there's smoke, if there's spheres, so yeah, I want to have full mana for the next pull. Especially whilst I'm waiting for the other heals to come in. Yep, alright, giving it to Soliana, congrats. Uh, next up, we have these healing boots, leather. Good. 
going on over to the track. And if you want anything for transmog, you can uh, do slash roll 50. What about the uh, flask? Oh. Flask? Doesn't matter. All right. All right, Bruce Nika, sending these over to you for uh, transmog. No, we are not going to make you flask for ZG. <laughs> yeah, no. <laughs> no, 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 I meant diamond flask. All right. All right. Oh. All right, let's see. Let's have these as well. These are going to be tank gloves. Bring them over to the off spec. All right. It's going to be going to Brisnica in five, four, three, two, one. Congrats. That's it for the loot. Going over to group loot again. As for uh, these next couple of packs, we're going to make sure that we uh, bring them over to this right side here. So we're going to pull them and then we're going to be standing here so we line of sight them. Otherwise, they do a lot of damage. You can pull. All right, let's pull the next pack up as well in the same manner. Make sure ranged, you're staying far away because the Blood Drinker does an AoE damage. That's gonna interrupt your cast. Make our way down, make sure you don't jump on these stairs or bridge, or it's gonna pull the path underneath. Next boss, uh, pretty simple boss. Uh, we're pretty much going to be hard focusing the boss. Uh, we need to make sure that two tanks is on it because it's going to gouge the one with the highest threat. Uh, so just make sure you pick it up. Uh, it's going to be crit. Make sure you're ready to pick it up if that happens. Uh, a random player is also going to be randomly marked uh, and all the panthers that spawn from the boss is going to aggro on top of them. So just be careful if that goes on you, just kite them around or something. Uh, if we, for some reason, don't have enough damage to one-face this boss, we're all going to be standing with our backs up against this bone wall here. So backs against it, because it's going to... Uh, the boss is going to teleport after a bit on top of a random player. Uh, if you And the thing is, it always goes behind you. So if you are standing with your back against the wall, it's going to spawn on the other side and not do any damage to you. Uh, let me see. Where do we have you, Rester Shaman? There you are. Bethlehem, your well, let's go. Calls upon your might. Oh, 
teleport's gonna vanish in 10 seconds. Alright, seems like we're entering phase two. Everyone backs against the walls. Most gonna return in approximately ten seconds. There's the boss. Killed it. Alright. Let's see what we got. No pack, sadly enough. Let's see here. Uh, we actually seem to have one SR, which is the arm splint. I will link all the loot. Oh, bit of trouble. There we go. Uh, the arm splint is SR'd by Baldnik. Congrats. Next up, uh, this is going to be a healing staff because it does healing power. Like no one wants it, let's bring it over to offspec. If you need it for your offspec healing or whatever else. Uh... Yeah, I didn't roll for main spec, but. Uh, yeah, that is, I would say that's your main spec. So, uh, I, uh, alright, let's see, Cetesis won the transmog roll, so I'm gonna give it first to Cetesis, make sure you transmog it, and then give it over to Georgica. And let's see here, and the blood trench seems you like not. trade items? Yes, uh, so 15 minutes after an item have been given out, you can trade it within the raid group. But it only oh, works that, in raids. That's awesome. Yeah, I used to equip it, then unequip it, and then trade it. Alright, uh, let's bring it over to Offspec first. Otherwise, it's going to be going to Bruce again. Right. No, 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 not, not, not to me, Zetasis. Give it to Jedica. Yes, the Charmin. Oh, yeah, yeah. The rest yeah, of the Charmin. I'll, yeah, I rolled for a Transmog as well, so yeah. You go trade it once. That's why only one person gets the transport because he passes the person that you want it. Awesome. Good job. Bring it over to Group Blue. Uh, we are going to do fish if anyone has the summoning mats, but I, I do not provide them myself. Should we please go over to the next boss? Try to avoid pulling the target back on the right as we come in here. Oh, like the wall. Make sure that the healers are here before you kill the first group. Oh, sorry, I apologize. Just ran straight past them. Oh, 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 oh. All right. We're going to be focusing the Zerker first. Yeah, that's why we hug against the ball so you don't pull up. All right. With the red tigers. Just go ahead and kill these tigers over here. 
And we're going to be pulling you. I would raise, but I've got no mana, so careful. Oh, you're right. Players resting. We should be with two healers. One, because one of the other healers is resting. And I was drinking. No, oh, okay, fair enough. Are we chasing the boss over the wall? Yes, yeah, we are chasing the boss. Uh, so let's see here. Uh, Elodie, have you done this uh, boss before? Do you know how pulling them works? All right. Uh, in that case, I will. Oh, let's get CC's out on Cetus's first. He used the wood pile. So yeah, I'm just making sure we don't have any surfers coming. Good. All right. All right. So uh, mount up and come with me. We're going to be going up this wall here. Uh, only hunters coming with me. Everyone else, you're staying back. Okay. All right. So, let's see. There is the boss. I'm going to be marking these. There we go. So, basically, you're just going to be pulling these uh, bosses right here. You're just going to be pulling them over the wall and then running back to where everyone else is. So uh, hop on the aspect of the Sheeta, shoot them, and run back. I'm unsure how the range exactly works, but you should be able to jump up there eventually. Can you reach them? Yeah, perfect. All right. Uh, so I'm going to quickly explain this boss before we pull. Uh, so yeah, we're going to have three tanks on this boss. Uh, so that's going to be Balnik, Brusnica, and Crit. Balnik, so you're going to be on Diamond. Brusnica, you're going to be on Triangle. And Crit, you're going to be on Circle. Uh, make sure that the Skull and Cross die first DPS. Uh, we need to make sure that Lorcan's heals get interrupted. Which is going to be, let's see here. Yes, that is going to be Triangle. Make sure Triangle gets kicked or pummeled or whatever 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 else you have. Count spell, yeah. Yeah, anything. Uh other than that, we gotta make sure they all die at the exact same time. I think we have about like five seconds or so window. So if there's one mob that has way more health than the others, you need to focus that one. Uh, once all of them have died at the same time, we're going to make sure that the uh, casters and tanks and everyone, you're standing against this hill here. Casters, you can actually go and hug the wall with your back. This is just because the boss does an AoE knockback, and uh, if you don't have the little hill behind you, you're going to be flying. Uh, a crit, you want to tank purple? Okay, all right. Uh... All right, so crit's gonna be on purple then. So let's see, it should be circle on bald neck then. All right, if everyone is ready, I'm gonna make sure that we get a ready check before we pull. All right, let's go, you can pull it. Nice, run back. Yes, make sure we are getting them stacked. Here they come. Okay, one of the tigers is running back. I don't know why, but fair enough. All right, and make sure we are spreading out the damage on these guys. I think I'll ask a little bit of help now. Good.
more damage on diamond. Alright. Good. Good, good. Kill the tiger. And everyone come back. We got this loot. Uh, let's see. Don't have anything like this, so there's going to be a main spec. There's going to be either pass or healer, depending on what you need. Healers are very game careful. Always check the healers before you pull anything. All right, going to Georgica. Congrats. Next up, we have the shawl as Paladin Hunter Mage. So Leona getting all the loot today. <laughs> now the mage pieces are quite good from CG. Let's get the rip. For sure. All right. Going to Leona. Uh, let's have the gloves of the tormented. This is going to be uh, physical DPS or tanking. Hot stick. All right. Uh, you are a disenchanter, correct, Chiro? I am, yes. All right, sending it to you. Mm -hmm. Loot. Mm -hmm. Sorry, and as advertising the sign up message, uh, the first node is HR to the guild. Do we have any miners? All right, we got two miners. Got three miners. All right. Uh, let's see. Fire, could you be so kind and take this first node? Uh, let me also make sure that we are clearing this pack here. And as for these axe throwers, uh, mages, if they start spinning, you need to make sure that you're spamming polymorph on them. You can pull them. Let's also clear the pack over to the left of the temple over here. Uh, here's a bunch of soldier, right? All right, fire. You get to keep that in that case. <laughs> uh, for this next vein, uh, we're gonna have a roll for it. So if you want it. Roll for now. Seems like it is going to be going to Kiker. Congrats. So no one else should be mining up besides Kiker. Right. Kiker, were you still interested in Edge of Madness? Did you bring the summoning mats? All right. Uh, we're gonna be doing a Edge of Madness as well, so let's not go any further forward. We're gonna be coming back. So this is a uh, special boss, because uh, every so often the rotation of bosses that spawn 
is going to be different, and you're going to be needing an item for each individual one in order to actually be able to turn it into a specific trinket item. Uh, you're going to be needing a specific uh, summoning maps uh, to actually be able to do these. But the reason a lot of people skip this is because of the ads that are, are before the boss here, the mad servants. They are very, very dangerous. When they die, they uh, spawn two void walkers that hit like a truck. Uh, so we need to make sure that the first pack over here gets pulled over to where I'm standing now. I'm a star. So the first pack, tanks, make sure you bring them over here. DPS, don't touch them until they are over here. And if you pull aggro, make sure they are back there again. Uh, all right, let's see here. Yes, exactly. We're gonna. The reason why we're pulling them there is because we're gonna be pulling them away. All right. In that case. Let's pull the single servant before we do anything else. Go ahead. Make sure it is in position a little bit further away. All right, everyone run away from it. We are running away from it. So hug the wall on the right side. Over by star. The totem is going to pull, by the way. Yep, you need. OK, all right, they're pulled. So this is a good example of what we don't do. So make sure you pull the totems, because... I'll call the pipe. All right. Nice. Oh, never, never mind, it worked up. It worked up. <laughs> All right. Uh, then we're going to actually be doing the, the same thing on this next pack here. So uh, go ahead and pull them. And make sure they are brought over all the way here. We want them to be as far away as possible, because after five minutes, they despawn. You can pull them. And no DPS until they're in position. And do not over fret. And make sure they die around the same time so they don't spawn one way too fast. All right. All right, run away. Run away. Pull totems. All right, next up, there's going to be this pack up here. We're going to be pulling this pack over into this corner. And we're, everyone is going to be standing over where Star is right now. So everyone come here. And no totems where they are going to be brought. Pull the totems. Good. All right. You can pull them. And once again, we're not going to be doing any damage until they're in position. OK, that's just two of them. I think it should be fine. Let's just bring it over. Guys, don't damage it. The Void Walkers has aggro. Don't damage. No damage. Bring them over. Bring them over. Yeah, all the way back to the corner, guys. Like, just keep all moving. the way back into the corner. All the way back. All right, should be good now. You can kill them. Okay, move away. Move away. All right, run, 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 run. Uh, all right, for these next two, because they didn't all get all the way pulled up there, we're going to instead be pulling them all the way over in front behind the, the vines at the very, very, very edge of the room there. You can do that now. Make sure you don't pull too many. All right, good, good. Good. That, that should be good. Kill them. And there might be some line of side issues here. But anyway. All right, good stuff. Uh, as for this next pack, let's bring it over to the left over here. So because of the Void Walkers being all the way in the corner there, we can line of sight them here. So you just bring them over into that corner. Go and ready. Make sure you don't line of sight heals though. 
And all ranged, make sure you're standing over where Star is now. One of them has a lot of health. Good. Kill them. Alright, and run away. Over to start. Everyone start. Got the Blood Priest. He's gonna die. Alright, and the next pack is going to be pulled all the way into the corner on the other side of the room. So straight ahead from where I'm looking right now. There should be a bunch of vines there, so you should see them. Uh, Baldnik, pick up the mad uh, or the uh, blood priest. We're going to be killing her. Oh, never mind. She is mind controlled. That works. Mad servants, all the way in the corner. We can kill him. I'm going to go back and loot the first lot of um, things that should just spawn by now, I think. Yep. We're killing the Blood Beast. Alright, uh, so for today's boss, I'm not entirely sure who it actually is that is getting spawned. I'm going to double check. <laughs> Otherwise, Kiker, you, you know which boss it is, right? Oh, okay, so you, you just want whatever it is. Okay. Alright. Uh, oh, void walkers, make sure you get them back under control. Otherwise, we're killing them. Alright, good. Alright, let's make sure we're eating our oranges. Loot's in the next slot. Might be going to the master looter. Uh. I'm just going to double check here. So there's going to be four of them. Does anyone have the calendar, actually? Do you have the calendar, Shiro? Not open, currently, no. Ah, okay. Oh, we'll, re we'll just wing it otherwise. Uh, a lot of them usually spawn ads, make sure they die, because they'll do a lot of damage, but they don't do anything other than that. Uh, we'll be bringing them over to where we are standing right now. Make sure you don't pull... The yeah, I, th I think it's responding. still... I think it's still Hazara. Yeah. So yeah, okay. there's going to be like four big ads. The like, um, giant shadowy apparitions of creatures. Yeah. They have very little health, but they hit really hard, so you have to be nuked down, preferably by casters. Alright, fair enough. Alright, we can pull it. Uh, right, so this guy apparently does an AoE mana burn, which is countered by mana burning him. So, uh, Warlocks, make sure you're casting Drain Mana, and Hunter, you're going to be spamming the Mana Drain ability. It's going to do an AoE Sleep, but so long as you have a Shaman with Tremor token in your party, it should be good. Kill the Tank. Alright, you're looking dead. Kill the Big Dunsel. We're staying range. far away range. Alright, well, the illusion is not getting pulled. Kill big. Kill big illusion. That's right. weapons where you don't kill them. One healer dead. There's just a clean up. Alright, good, good. They're all dead, good stuff. And then there's one more illusion. See if you can kill him. Alright, good stuff, good stuff. Alright, let's make sure we got the spawn out. And today, there was only one item that got dropped. Uh, so this trinket item is going to be going over to Kiker, as he is the one to pay for it. Congrats. Yep, today was only one. Yep, sometimes you only get one. Yeah, but you only need one, so it's fine. Uh, but we have one drop, so uh, this is a shadow wand. This is good if you do not have a Shadow Wand, because it can be used in Black Moon Layer, for example, when it has a resist against all spells except Shadow. So any mage want that? Or Warlock, or anything? Alright, 
It's going to be going over to Citizens. Congrats. All right. We can start clearing again. That was a very clean Edge of Madness, I will say. No, it's one, one death. Oh, fucking hell. Uh, don't pull, don't pull, please. Oh, we're pulling, we're pulling more behind. Come back. I believe Red Attacky's up next after Hazara and then Wushalay after that. Because I need Red Attacky and Wushalay's items. So I'll definitely be bribing whoever runs those. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, I've got Grillex and Hazara's already. Uh uh. Gotcha, gotcha. Is the, the priest trinket good? Yep, yeah, I'll, I'll link it. It's pretty solid. Really good to Ooh. use. You said uh, clutch situations, yeah. Like in rage phase and stuff. That is actually really good. 40% quicker, greater heals, and 50% cheaper heals, yeah. That's pretty nice. And then like patchwork or something? Yeah. Alright, uh, next packs, we're gonna have two of the Blood Drinkers polymorphed. Oh, okay, you already pulled. Uh, make sure you polymorph the targets, don't AoE. We're gonna be focusing the priest first. So I'm gonna put Exploit in that. Oh, there's a, too much AoE going on, guys. AoE, st uh, ranged AoE, because they're the blood drinkers do an AoE. Pretty nasty. Alright, we're focusing the blood drinker with the skull. No AoE, guys, please. Alright, we're focusing on square next. Definitely need a mana drink after this, because it's quite intense. Yep. Alright. Time to spin spread all over the place. And then we kill Moon. Alright, Voidwalker's dead. Alright. Let's yeah. drink mana before we do anything. Oh, there's actually one more blood drinker. Got a mind control. Alright, nice. Good stuff, good stuff. So we're not pulling anything else. Aseni is also dead. We need to make sure that they are rest. All oh, this hate is mana, so just hold up a sec. Elrez? Elrez, make sure you get your mana healers. I'm not important. Fire does not care. <laughs> all right. Next pack, we're going to be all stacking up in the corner like people that have already started doing because these guys do a knockback. is pulled. Alright. 
Let's see here. Let's pull the raptors on the left first, but make sure we get mana. We are not pulling before healers have mana. Yeah, I'd berserker straight after that full pack. <laughs> I'll do buffs just before the boss to see nice pointless doing spot buffs the minute. Yeah. Because we, okay. we keep having like odd people dying here and then. It just it just takes too much mana to buff one person. Yep. Drink enough as it is. Alright, you should be able to pull. Right. Let's pull the champion. Stuff, good stuff. Uh, this next pack, let's just make it easy. We'll have one, two, there we go. That's just uh, for the mages. We're obviously going to be focusing the priests. You can pull. Let's not have too much AOE going on here, so. They can be actually pulling more. Kill Moon. Kill the boat drunker. All right. Don't think we need to pull any more packs, so we should be good. Uh, I'm gonna quickly go over this boss as well. Uh, for this boss, we're going to be having two tanks. Uh, we're gonna have one tank on the troll and one on the raptor. Uh, Crit, you're gonna be on the troll. Volnik, you're gonna be on the raptor. Uh, we're gonna have a hunter pet be standing over here where Star is now. So just put your hunter pet here. This is to eat the charge when the boss does that. So just make sure it stays there. Good stuff, good stuff. Uh, uh, also, this boss is going to randomly gaze at random people. If you get gazed, you're clicking escape two times. If you do literally anything, he's gonna instantly kill you. You don't want that. So, escape twice. If you get gazed, I'm going to call that out as well. Uh, if you die, do not accept the res that uh, is going to be prompted, because uh, that is going to buff the boss. Uh, around when the boss is at like 20 or so percent health left, you can accept the res. Uh, other than that, we need to make sure the raptor is faced away from the troll. That's because it does a cleave sunder effect. Uh, other than that, should be good to go. Let's have uh, the troll where Star is now. And then we have Raptor over here. We should be ready. Warriors, you can go in on the speaker. Just get some rage. Warriors only. All right, boss is coming. I'll feed your souls to her We're going to be itself. focusing the troll first, everyone. Pull it further back. Oh, a crit is dead. Uh, Bruce Nigga, you're gonna. Oh, never mind. You accept. Never mind. All right, crit is back alive. We are focusing the troll, and pull it into position, so that our casters don't get charged, and fear. Well, okay, Bruce Nigga, pick it up. Make sure Bruce Nigga is healed. All right, I. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Yeah, so I, st I started healing the beginning. I did have my fucking heals up on my hotbar. The one back. 
and then I got feared, so I couldn't heal during the second yeah. death. And... Yeah, that's why it's very important that we bring him over to where I said we should. Because otherwise it does a AoE charge yep. on uh, fear, I mean. Uh, yep. It is what it is. Do I have a soul stone up? Um, or, or maybe put a DI on me, yeah, because it's going to be a wipe. I got to reincarnate. Okay, cool. Yeah, yeah. Wait to accept the rest if the ghost asks you. Yeah, that was annoying. Yeah, so I right. had the wrong fucking bar. I was <laughs> spamming to heal, and if it was happening, then oh. yeah, crit died. Everything just sort of spiraled from there. All right, we got it. we got one soul stone. Let's get those rests up. You should have enough mana. Just get some healers up, so they can also drink and start dressing. Maximize efficiency. So rest the people that can rest first. Which is already being done. Good stuff. Right, no. So, Crit, uh, you're tanking the uh, the troll, and Baldnick is tanking the raptor. Make sure, for simplicity's sake, that you get your uh, uh, demoralizing shout and thunderclap applied on, on top of uh, using thunders. Sure, we get the man up back before we do anything. <laughs> Seems like we got all of the buffs good. Go, uh, mana is looking good. Let's have a Full timer for five seconds. Four, three, two, one. So once again, you're your yeah, to troll on the left cell. and raptor on the right. There we go. Beautiful. A little bit further. A little bit further back. There we go. Fire being watch. I think uh, yeah, pull it pull the raptor back a little bit uh, or not the raptor, I mean the, the troll a little bit further back. I don't think it's in the range of the hunter pit. Not that way, not that way, other way. Pull him over here, where I'm standing now. Good stuff, good stuff. Make sure at range you're not too far away, or he's going to charge at you. Okay, you're being watched. Alright. Oh, I am stupid. My bad. Everybody uh, pass and everything. Everybody yeah, pass. Pass and everything. I'll see if you have rolled in anything. Uh, 
That's my bad. It is an emergency mitten as EG without at least one boss where if you get to put boss leader. <laughs> exactly. It doesn't matter who the right lock leader is. Alright, well, everyone should have already seen the drops, but I will link them again. Uh, that is going to be the second idol of the day, which means anyone is allowed to SR roll this. Go ahead. And if you have two SRs, you're rolling it twice. Big roll today for me. <laughs> Uh, Jared, you lead. do not have two, an SR on it? No, it was kind of late as I was going, but it's okay, you can ignore my roll. I, I mean, it's too, to be fair, you didn't win anyway, so... <laughs> uh, you right. can still ignore it. Yeah, 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 it's fine. Let's see, uh, we got, alright. Seems like Crit is the one that won. Congrats. Really, yeah, I think, because um, you're not long to the 60, right, Soliana? I mean, really, idols, obviously, you can suffer certain if you want, but ideally, you want them going to people of tier 2 yep. or above, because, yeah, they're limited supply. Caster DPS. This is a very good Caster DPS ring. It is. It Like, the set bonus from this, if you get the other ring as well, is... Some of the best rings you can get before you get into like AQ40 or an axe. And it looks like Soliana is the one taker. I'm going to be giving it to Soliana in five, four, three, two, one. Congrats. We need Spider, yeah? Um, someone's asking. Yeah, we need Spider. Uh, a lot of people still up near the boss, I don't know why. Um, yeah, going. don't stand around, you can start. Clearing stuff. Uh, let's see, we do not have anything on the buying things. Alright. Main spec. This is a Paladin Hunter Mage item. I think it's braces for a mage. Yep. Yeah. I'm gonna bring it over to off spec. I think Soliana already got one. Yep. Yeah. Alright, in that case, I'm leaving it on the body. If you have second thoughts, I'll leave it there. You can just pick it up. Uh, let's see here. Anything on this? Don't uh, release said this, by the way, because I can't. Yeah. Need main a, spec. This is uh, melee DPS. Need alliance to res said this because he released. Oh, I can bring any res. Bring it over to off spec. Sending it over to Shiro. Bring it over to Group Loop. All right, before we start pulling, gotta make sure that everyone's up to par on how this works. Alessius yes, can my control um, the Shadow Casters if he wants to. Yep. Let's make sure you mark um, the one that, so people don't attack it. All right, coming on up now. Let's see if we can get some marks out on the spiders. Let's see, where's the last one? There it is, I think. No? No. Is that it? I oh, yeah, just one. Alright, so as you can see by the three marks I've placed, there is three spiders that are roaming around this place. We gotta make sure that we pull the packs when one of the skitterers is directly next to a pack of mobs. Otherwise it might pull two or maybe even three packs, which is going to kill us. Uh, but for anything, we can pull the right side. Yep, you got it. You can, uh, yeah, use the mind control moon. Good stuff. This pack is dead. These packs are pretty heavy on the damage. Yeah, careful for Snicker because you're quite flimsy. I'm what? Squishy. No, I'd prefer flimsy. 
Alright. Before we pull again, let's get the res out. Could also kill the Shadowcaster, of course. I forgot about it. There's the one bad thing about the uh, wing trolling it. I forgot about it. <laughs> Alright. I think I was about to say something, but then I forgot. Here's what I oh yeah, right. Uh, if your screen tar starts uh, being very blurry, uh, what you can do is you can go into video options and disable the full screen glow effect underneath shaders. Just click it off so it's unticked and you should not be having any problems with blurry screens anymore. Uh, if you have any sort of disarm gloves or anything, make sure you equip them as an immune to disarm. Very useful here. All right. Once we get a skitterer next to this pack to the left, we can pull the next pack. Should be green. Perhaps? No? Uh, do you want to mark one of them for my controlling? Shadowcasters. Yeah. yeah, sure. Uh, let's make it a square. All right, let's pull them out. Pull pink. Yep, leave square and let Alessius um, my control. Yep. Make sure we are focusing down the trolls first before the spiders. Alright, you can drop mind control. Get some mana back up. That was a clean pull. Make sure we don't uh, overstep, so we pull a skidrear when we don't want to. Come back, Balnick. While we're still drinking up. Uh, Teriyaki, do you apparent uh, do you have some sort of uh, DPS meter add-on? You should probably disable that in that case. It adds a lot of lag to it, especially when there's a lot of enemies on the screen. Because it has to track every single instance individually, which makes it lag. Alright, uh, let's wait for the next pack here. Let's make sure we get a sketcher next to it. Before we pull. It's looking like a circle. Pull it now. Good stuff. Clean, clean, clean. Make sure you don't line of sight healers with uh, these eggs here. The warlocks flew too close to the sun. He's evading. Good stuff. All right. Let's take a here. We can move forward a bit. Let's make sure we get mana first though, and also that everyone gets rest up. Better give it a lot of loot, but it is very easy for the entire raid to die, which is the downside of it. 
All right, we should be able to pull the next pack. Pull them already. Let's go ahead. The skidder did not even get pulled. I'll read to my controller, should I? Yep. Good stuff. And then the shadow caster. All right. That's this room clear. Very clean room. Let's see here. Uh, so this boss has uh, some pretty annoying mechanics. This boss is also kind of shit. I'll be real. But we're going to be killing it anyway. Uh, the boss is going to be spawning these big spiders. We need to kill them ASAP because the longer they're alive, the stronger they become. Uh, and the boss is going to be switching between uh, a troll and a spider form. In the spider form, it AoE roots and silences people around her. Uh, so we need to have one tank sitting in the caster group ready to taunt her and bring her back to the melee group. Uh, we're going to have, uh, let's have Baldnik. You're going to be sitting with the casters. And crit, you're going to be main tanking the boss. Because you do a lot of damage. Which means good threat. Alright. Uh, in that case, let's start it. And once again, spiders first, everyone. Just pu pull the boss where it is right now. Just charge in. Alright, there's spiders, spawn of Marley. We are killing them. Make sure that we also get rid of the totems that have spawned. Don't stand too close, Baldnick, or you're gonna get hit by the AoE silence as well. Caster stand further back. Try and pull the boss a little bit further away. Alright, pull, pick it up. Good stuff. Oh. We have it loose. Any any warrior, anything, pick it up. Alright, I got it. Pick it up, bring it over to where it was. Let's make sure that crits won't put the deep. Yep, alright, Baldi, come back. Good stuff. And before I forget, Master Luther. I'm bringing it over. She's in troll form. We're fine for a little bit. And boss is dead. We're killing the spiders. Good stuff, guys. Only one death. Actually, two deaths. Let's say there's one death. Just to make it sound nice. Alright. We got the following items here today. Uh, let's see here. These boots. Main spec. Some sort of... I don't really know where this, who would have this, but like I guess like rogues. Maybe DPS warriors if they have nothing else. It is 1% crit. Rogues cannot wear mail, so... Oh yeah, right. Them. It is mail. Yeah, I don't know who the fuck would want this. Hunters, yeah, hunter. Oh, hunter. hunter. Yeah. Oh, that's Hunter. Sure. I forgot about them. All right, let's bring it over to Offlick. All right, sending it over to Shiro. Oh, Georgica wants him. Giving to you. Next up, we have the Stanchion. That is going to be Priest, Warlock, Druid. Once again, you're going to be needing a bit of rep to be able to turn these in. You should be the one knowing whether it's worth it for you or not. All flick, for whatever reason. It's also nice for uh, collecting. Giving it to Peng Peng. 
Yeah, guys, maybe wait for everyone to be there before you start pulling shit. Well, there's hardly any of us actually on the corner. Yep. We got melee DPS slash tanks. All right. It'll be going to Brisnica in five, four, three, two, one. Correct. Yeah, but the point still stands there, Bolnick. Like, not many people are even there. He just ran aside to pull them closer to us, like, just wait a bit longer. Loop. Don't forget, if you equipped the sorum gloves, you should unequip them now. We look pretty good on mana and whatnot, you can pull. Go ahead. <clears throat> All right, let's get those snakes. In the meanwhile, I'll start going over this next boss. There we go. All right. Uh, we're not going to be clearing out the rest of this room. We are good as we are right now. Uh, this boss, uh, first of all, there's going to be the four ads. I'll mark them now. All right, we got these four ads. They need to die before the boss. Uh, all ranged and healers and everything, you are max ranging the boss because in his first phase, he's going to be doing a chain lightning. And that chain lightning is going to wipe the entire raid if you are standing too close. So if you are ranged, you're standing up on this little hill here. All ranged. I'll actually give myself a square. Everyone that is ranged, you're standing with square. Master Ruther, yes. Uh, yes. And also, once the boss is in the second phase, once he reaches about, I think it's 40% health, he is going to be putting a bunch of fart clouds everywhere. You're not standing in the fart clouds, so make sure you're constantly running around. Also, we didn't have to pull those, but I guess we're killing this pack as well. Alright. In that case, uh, let's get some our mana back up and. Yeah, okay, yes. Crits, you're gonna be on the ad, Baldnick, you're gonna be taking the boss. Sorry, I... Brain moment. Alright. Uh, you can pull him ready, crit. Oh, he is dazed. Make sure he doesn't die. Right, we're killing the mobs first, bring the boss away from the cobras. Good. Alright, let's the boss. Ranged, you are max ranging the boss. Max ranging, or you're gonna kill everyone. Alright, there's the boss. Pick it up. 
Poison cloud, don't stand in it. Poison cloud. And the boss is going to leave a poison cloud when he dies. Don't stand there. Get away from the boss. Alright. Clean. It uh, should be good to loot now. Today we have these items. Oh, I, yeah, have, ring. I have a charger ring, so uh, Fair enough. <laughs> congrats me. <laughs> and then we have the Primal Hakari Tabard. I'm pretty sure you need Exalted to be able to turn this in. No, Revered. 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 Okay, it's Revered. So if uh, that is a chest piece item, uh, Pretty good. As no one is rolling for it. Literally roll for any reason. Paladin Shaman Druid. Just take it, please. Collection purposes. Transmog. <laughs> Again, right. there's a lot of people hanging about. Come on, move forward. Yep. Jurjika, it's going to you. Yep, nice. And then we have this cape. This is going to be a melee slash hunter DPS. Essentially any physical DPS. And I bring that over to our oh. In fact, can, can I make a request? Can we kill this pack in the tent yep. just near the bridge? Because someone nearly always asks Paul it on the way to yeah. the car. I'd rather we just, yeah, like literally right now. Kill it. Kill the pack. Also, you know what? I'll give a star and a... A diamond to the tanks. Not in the hard way, right? Uh, we're spamming polymorph. Pol polymorph the axe thrower. Spam polymorph. Yeah, I'm getting perma stunned here. If you're not using polymorph constantly on the axe thrower, it's going to make it so everyone near the axe thrower can't do anything. Circle. Yeah, it's good we pull that pack now rather than running towards the camp, because otherwise it's more annoying if people have jumped already. Yep. I'm in personal, I just don't trust a lot of people. Especially those I don't know very well. Yeah, it's usually like that. Alright, oh, it's still in Mass Luther. My bad. Here we go. Alright, uh, for these next packs, we gotta make sure that the Bat Risers, uh, they are going to start exploding at 40% health, and very quickly after, they are exploding. Uh, when they explode, they're gonna essentially one-hit anyone close by. So unless we don't have the damage, I don't want to try it. We are running away from it. Let me repeat that, we are running away from the Bat Riders. Yeah, we don't quite have the DPS to serve them. Yeah, I don't think so. If I'm on the DPS meter as a second, I think uh, we should not do it. <laughs> yeah, I know we've got a few um, relatively fresh level 60s. Yeah. At least a couple. Let's focus school first. It's exploding, run away. Range, run, 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 everyone's running. All right, good stuff. Could have been worse. We're pulling the pack on the right side. Great mana break after. Yep. I see. All right, let's start running away. Oh, we killed it. Nice. <laughs> All right, we are okay. All right, Poach, uh, use mana potions, whatever healers. Make sure that you have mana for this. Shouldn't be too bad though. All right, run away. It's dead. All right. Do you have your skinners for the primal bats, by the way? Okay, so get primal bat level. Oh yeah, that's a good idea. If anyone is a leather worker, just pick all of this leather up. Skinner. 
Yep. What did I say? Leather worker. Oh, yeah, no, Skinner. Yep. They they essentially have the same iPhone, and I always bring them together, so <laughs> confused too. All right. We can Let's see. Let's bring the uh, witch doctor and headhunters. Let's take those first. But now, and let's focus the headhunter first. It does a stun thing. It's very annoying. And the Witch Rockers is going to spawn a ghost once it dies. If it's targeting you, you're running away. You will know it's targeting you if it's start it's floating right towards you. Alright. Just like the Sunken Temple Ghost. Yep. All right, so run away from school, run away from cross. Nice. We have one death. Let's make sure we get them rest. I'm resting. Can't drink the moment because the ghost's alive. Yep. Still can't drink. Oh my god, these ghosts are going to go away. <laughs> okay, what give the fuck? Okay, I, uh, they should not be up this long, seriously. Yeah, no, give him a hug. Fuck off, right. Casper, you little shit. Yeah. Alright, uh, let's bring this next back. Pull back. Good stuff. One way. And run away. He's dead. All right, and then we have one more pack left. We're pulling some bats from above as well. <laughs> yeah, you can just take them where, you, where they are right now. Oh, shit. I pulled one. Bring it over. Watch out for school. There's one across. Alright. Let's have our miners roll for the next orb. And if you've already had the ore, I'm asking you to not take this next one. Awesome. All right, ping ping, go ahead. Let's uh, clear some bats out from the sky. Nah, you're not getting your rage mouse. I'm going my evil arc. All right. Uh, this boss has some pretty simple mechanics, but I'll go over them real quick. Uh, so she is going to be uh, doing an AOE silence around her at all times, basically. Uh, ranged, you're staying at max range, as in max range, okay? Uh, so let's have range over where we have, let's see. I'll give myself a circle. Circle, you're going to be standing, or uh, like range stand with circle. And then let's have our hunter. You're going to be standing over here. Okay. And let's have the boss over here. Where I'm standing right now. All right. Uh, so once. Uh, that we got we also gotta make sure that the boss is faced away from the melee group because she does a cleave in front of her. Uh the reason why we are having the hunter standing over there is because she does a charge and this used to eat it basically. 
we need to make sure that uh, when she does her mind flay and heal, we are interrupting. Uh, she's also going to be doing an AoE fear once she enters her second phase. So make sure you put down a tremor totem. Uh, other than that, don't stand in the firebombs that get uh, thrown in the second phase. Other than that, go ahead. Lord Herik, grant me wings of vengeance. Once again, ranged. Try to stand as close to circle as possible. And don't have any pets or anything of your own. Alright, and Dream Six is taking place now. Mind play. I am running over here, Peng Peng. Stop with the damage. Let's make sure it's boss in position. Good. Alright. Alright, well, it's just gonna lose now. I need to do Master Loot. Oh my god. Last second. I did this the entire last CG I did as well. Very last second, all the time. Alright. Pretty clean boss kill. Uh, let's see if we have any SRs. Don't think we do. Uh, healer main spec. Yeah, those are good shoulders for your druid healer. I, I should also put this, this uh, the other loot. Off spec. Yeah, I wore those on my um, cow druid healer for a while. Oh yeah. All right, sending it over to Sharon. Let's have this priest warlock druid. If you uh, don't have these yet, for just take them. It's just nice for collection. It also gives you a little bit extra rep when you turn them in. I am. I don't know if anyone wants this. I'll do it for good measure, but I don't think anyone wants this. Let's bring it over for the one-handed mace. This is healers. Does not seem like anyone is interested. I'll bring it over to Optic. I'm actually interested, but I just won the uh, stuff earlier. I take it. This this could be nice. I'm. He's uh, for it. Go for it. Yep, take it. Better than the sitting there rolling on the body. And yeah. I'm going to be leaving the token item on the body. If anyone has second fast later. Moving over to group two. Uh, so for this next part, uh, let's start to get this Berserker as well. But for this next part, we're only going to be having uh, the tanks, me and the hunter going upstairs. We're going to be pulling all the mobs down here. Alright. So... Let's get some mana back up. Let's see if we can find anything up here. So, Rogue, you're standing downstairs. Uh, that seems to be a double pack. Let's not fuck with that. Uh, let's see if we have anything on the left. There is a pack that is, let's see if it's coming towards or away from us. All right, seems like it's coming towards us. Uh, also, can we have uh, mages, actually? Uh, let's have Aseni come up. If your name has not been called, you are staying downstairs.
I've got sunny. Good, good. Awesome. Yes. So you are sheeping moon. That's neat. Uh, but let's make sure that the it is not standing over there. So uh, pull it now. And once it has been pulled, basically to the the stairs right here. Make sure you polymorph it. Let's uh, jump down. All right. That's a good poly. These guys hurt like trucks. Try not to pull aggro. Are we killing this? Don't forget you can just jump off the stairs. Yeah, like that. And it's going to pull them. So you just jump off once you have pulled the pack. Make it way easier. Oh, well, I'm gonna... There we go. All right. Uh, right looks pretty good right now. Let's pull it. Oh, unlucky. Yeah, Hunter, take it. Pull it. Hunter should be the one pulling. Take it before it's gone. It's still fine. Nice. Yeah, you jump, just, down, jump down the yeah, ledge. Just jump. Just jump down. Yeah, yeah just jump down the ledge because then they've got to chase you all the way around. All right. Good moon. Let's kill moon. Bring it down. You just jump off the ledge. Crit. You just jump down. You just jump off. Yeah, because I say this is down here, so it just makes more sense to jump off so we can hear you. Yep. Full Thanks center. Yep. Alright. Good stuff. Oh. Okay. Got two helmets. Interesting. Uh, let's see if we can... See how this is looking on the left here. Uh, left looks like pretty good right now. But let's wait a little bit. Got to make sure we got mana back and everything. I'm out of oranges. Okay, I can't drink. All right, I'm drinking uh, tea. Uh, let's see, is there anything behind? You can pull. Place a frost trap as well. Good. Here they come. Get sheep on moon as well, please. Two mages. Why is moon not getting sheep? Tuliana. Good. We're not AOEing the moon. Pull them off again. Good. Let's focus down the priest first. Always the priest first, guys. Alright, killing this old bear. Nice. And the last one. Oh, good. Happy. Good stuff. Pretty clean. Uh, I think we could have one more mage table. Or does anyone have like, extra oranges they haven't used yet? I uh, need them on circle, please. Are we getting more oranges? We're getting more oranges this time. Let's get mana back. Let's see if we can pull right when possible. Don't do it too... We should be good. Pill it. It's just me. Alright. And let's see if we got the priest. Focus the priest. Make sure that soul player gets polymorphed. Good. All right, there's another soul player. Other mage, you need to polymorph that. Good. All right. 
let's start with the unmarked. And the No deaths. That should be all the packs, right? I believe so. Alright, uh, let's just kill this son of a car right now. We can all go upstairs. Perfect. Uh, so, for this boss, there is uh, two mechanics that we need to be aware of. Uh, the first one is that uh, this boss is going to randomly mind control uh, the one with the highest threat on there. Uh, that means that uh, me and Georgica, we're going to be sitting in the same group. Uh, sorry, Brusnika, you're not going to have Wind Fury for this fight. But this is just to make sure that we are placing down our grounding totems. Uh, so, let's have it like this. Uh, Georgica, place yeah. down Wind Fury. I'll take care of grounding totem. Uh, sure. Let's make sure everyone has mana. Everyone needs to drink up. Actually, we don't... I just realized we don't need a hunter in this group. You're getting back, Brisnika. All right. Uh, let's see here. Let's uh, have uh, Seni. You are pulling the soul of a car on the left side. Just pull him up and then polymorph. Uh, reason why we're doing this is because the boss is going to be doing an AOE suck blood on everyone. And as you've guys seen earlier, once the son of a car dies, they drop a poison cloud. So uh, before. The boss is about to do the suck. We all got to make sure that we are basting in the poison. Uh, this is so the boss drinks a bunch of poison instead of health, which means that it doesn't heal, but take damage from sucking us. Uh, other than that, it was pretty simple. I've already gone over with the grounding totem. Usually, if we didn't kill any of the priests that we have done today, uh, it would actually result in the boss having all the abilities of those bosses. And from what I know, there's only one single run that has actually been able to kill Hakar with all those buffs enabled, which was earlier this week. Uh, Alright, let's get the poly. Oh, make sure it's getting healed. Alright, we got the polymorph on the left. Let's start. First, my control is going out in six seconds. So my grounding totem is in position, which should not be a problem. So the weapon is going to be going out in 55 seconds. So we're just pumping. Start killing the son of a car on the left side. Kill it now. And everyone get a bit of the poison. Don't poison cleanse. Everyone needs to dip themselves. Alright. Most people are seem to be dipped. Here comes the suck. Alright. 
Yeah. 36.7 seconds of five cylinders. <laughs> Warriors were clapping. As per usual. Alright. Uh, Seni, do you think you could... Oh, okay, so uh, Baldnik is mind controlled. Make sure we CC. Uh, Seni, could you pull up the son of a car on the left? Or right, I mean? Or on the right side? Right side? Let's kill it. Guys, kill son of a car right now. Everyone's on son of a car. This is risky. No, we're not going to do it. We need to kill the son. Alright. Everyone dip. Oh yeah, you say son, not just... And that should be the boss. At first I thought you, you meant new car, then I realised no, you did say son. Oh no. <laughs> yeah, say, yeah. <laughs> yeah, we did not have to damage it. The end justified the means. All right, and that was Hakar. Now let's see what we can find here today. Peacekeeper gauntlets when the rest when the paladin healer already has them. Let's see, it does not seem like anyone wants them, but uh, or as far anyone. So let's go over to main spec roll. That's a healer item. Far but there's only it. really paladin that can do anything with it, right? So it's probably going to be going over to Disenchant. Yeah, uh, the cloak doesn't exist. Not even for a diamond flask set. <laughs> Alright, uh, let's see, do we have any SRs on part of the card? We do, we have Soliana. Uh, 